dinos. Today we're going to draw the Texas state flower, which is the blue bonnet. I have a real blue bonnet plant here, and you can see that blue bonnets grow in the soil. They have stems and leaves and the flower, and this one even has a little seed pot on it. Up here we have a picture of a blue bonnet. So I'm going to draw a blue bonnet first. I'm going to start with a marker. You can start with a marker or paint or crayons, however you want to do it. But I'm going to draw some stems. And then I'm going to draw some leaves. The blue bonnet leaves are kind of at the bottom and they're kind of long. You can draw lots of leaves. If you look down at the blue bonnet plant, you can see that there's lots of leaves on the blue bonnet. But I'm just going to draw a few today. So then we're gonna take a little bit of paint. You can either use your finger in the paint to make little dots like this to make a blue bonnet and cover up the whole top of that stem with little dots. Look at that. And if you don't wanna to touch the paint or you just wanna do something else fun, you can use a Q-tip like we paint with sometimes in class. Whoop, drippy. And you can just put little dots all over the stem. Just like that, dot, 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 dot. Make lots and lots of little dots for that blue bonnet. And blue bonnets are flowers, so they need sun and water to grow. If you want, you can even draw a sun on your blue bonnet picture. So I hope that you have a lot of fun drawing blue bonnets. Um, if you make some blue bonnets, uh, ask your mom or dad to email a picture of it to me. Uh, I can't wait to see them.